Hey guys, we've just arrived in Ubud and I just wanted to show you our room. Already we've noticed that the mosquitoes up here are more prevalent and hungry. Um, we've got a mosquito net over our bed, which is good. We've got a outdoor area with table and chairs where we are fed breakfast tomorrow, which is very romantic. Romantic hope. Yes. <laughs> um, this is our bedroom. We've got a mosquito net. Nice large bed. Air conditioning. This is our bathroom door. Feels like a Moroccan door. And this is the bathroom. Toilet and shower. Very nice. Just arrived in Uber. We're just like in a cafe having lunch and the view is pretty cool. monkey forest just trying to find our way back to our hotel because it's a bit of a shortcut. Yeah, where's the path just here? So we could cross over and go down that way, we'll go down this way. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, we're just about to go out for dinner now. I won't take the camera with me, um, so I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning. Um, I slept rather badly last night. There was a big thunderstorm at about half one in the morning and there was loads of rain like it felt like someone was pouring a bucket of water on our roof so I was panicking about it flash flooding <laughs> I went up to the window about three or four times just to check that it wasn't flooding in um, the moss mozzies here are pretty bad and even though I'm wearing insect repellent um, they have still managed to bite me oh, twice on my leg Gee going out now for an explore. I just wanted to show you our pool area. Pretty, we've not been in it yet. We only arrived yesterday, so plenty of time for that. I've just come in the monkey forest. I'm a little bit scared to have my camera out. Basically grab it. There you go, she's going to help you. <laughs> Jebba, go higher and I'll climb up you. Oh. <laughs> 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 there you are, they're just taking them out. He's yeah, just sitting there, he's guarding you. He's quite happy. I don't know. Amazing that. God, he's greedy, isn't he? Oh my god.
has avocado salad. Nice, lovely view. Hey guys, just about to head out for dinner. We've just been planning what we're going to do tomorrow. Um, so I think we might get up early and go and have a walk around the rice terraces and then perhaps hire a scooter and go and see a chocolate factory which is about 20 minutes south of Ubud. Hey guys, this morning we are doing a walk on the Cam Kempucan Ridge in Ubud. We've been up since 5am this morning, it's now about 7. Now it's gone, it's like bloody half six. Half six. I reckon it's getting towards 7. Um, it took us about an hour maybe to walk to the start point because we're staying near the monkey forest and we've been walking probably only for about five minutes if that so far so good the scenery is really nice it's quite quiet I probably wouldn't want to leave it any later starting um, but no it's nice just walking along the ridge and guess what we've seen that thing there it's called a scorpion Scary. You can see its little stinger on its tail. Just walking back, I walk back to the hotel is just at the side of the monkey forest. There's this little cheeky monkey just reaching into the cage and eating the potatoes. We just got back from our walk along the ridge through the rice fields and we're just having breakfast. Lovely um, brekkie on the balcony, watermelon juice and fruit platter and there's eggs on the way as well. Looks like it might be a beautiful sunny day. Hi, hello. Hey uh, Jabba, this is how you crash. <laughs> We've had a little bite. We have just come to the organic chocolate farm just outside of Ubud and it's made um, out of bamboo, the factory is. We are having a tour of the chocolate factory now. We just have to put these hair nets on. Just want to show you how beautiful Ben looks. <laughs> this is the machine that makes the chocolate beans into the paste. It grinds it up. It's a big machine from Switzerland. arrived at Gunung Kawai um, and this is the sign so ladies you're not allowed in if you're on your period so just walking down all the steps to the temple um, the drive here took us about 40 minutes mm, it's quite a good drive and, um, on our little scooter, so. it cost us 15,000 each to get in which is 75 pence and we just put, have to have to buy sarongs each. So, I'll show you Ben. I don't know if we had to, but they said we had to if we brought them. Yeah, you have to cover up. So, Ben had to get one, and I got one too. Quick 
with fifty. So I had this with me already for my shoulders, but I had to buy this one. So I got a psychedelic sarong for sixty for two. So um, which is that? Three pounds for two sarongs, which is not too bad. So there's all these stone carvings in the rock, which is quite talented, isn't it? We're now just about 20 minutes south of the first temple we were at. And we're at a place um, that's called an elephant cave. Just past the waterfalls just south of Ebud. Looks pretty spectacular. Hey guys, we're just heading out now to get a facial and then head for dinner. Hey guys, so we're back at the hotel now. We had a facial, we had a natural facial. So they put like this yogurt stuff all over our face and then like honey and then a mud mask. I'm not really sure if I liked it or not. I'm still trying to decide whether the pain is good for you or whether it's not meant to be painful because like when they were doing our facial that was nice but then they started like massaging your arms and your head and your neck and stuff and the arm bit was like really painful so I'm still trying to decide whether the pain means it's working or whether it just means um, she doesn't know what she's doing <laughs> so tonight's our last night in Ubud and tomorrow we're gonna go back to Seminyak again from Seminyak we fly to New Zealand <laughs> 